Welcome to Murder Mondays. It is not a Monday, but there has been murder. Not sure why I started off like that. A new story has arisen from the ashes. Like the zombies rising from the ground, they have risen. Miss Switzerland finalist. So if you don't know what Miss, whatever it is, it is a uh, beauty pageant, I think would be the polite word, where people dress up, you know, with their makeup, wear tight shit, you know, do make themselves look good and perform in front of people. She does that, makes makes cash, makes a lot of walonga, probably, I don't know. She was a finalist. Now, I didn't choose this word. Strangled to death then pureed in a blender by her husband. Now, one question you might ask, what is a puree? Like, you know when you get that sauce and it comes out all like, it's a bit of a thicker, you know, like a tomato puree comes out, you put it on a pizza maybe, I don't fucking know. But her husband turned it into, or tried to blend her up to, uh, you know, get rid of it. It should be noted these two had kids, which is just either one makes you distrust humanity even more i mean having being married having kids and then ending up in a smoothie uh, a human smoothie to to make it worse you know i mean what on earth let's delve deep come on boys come join me so i did go on the new york timer but it was had more ads than a uh, illegal website to stream football or whatever you do it had more ads than pornhub which is outrageous <laughs> Miss Svetlana Fana strangled this man but I'm pure red and blend up by husband. Hold on. It was a bit rude to say it in that accent, you know what I mean? We're talking about a serious situation here. <clears throat> so Miss Switzerland, finalist, was strangled, dismembered, and put into a smoothie blender by her husband. End quote. If you want to join in along with me here, we'll read a few points out, give our impressions, and uh, firstly, obviously, horrible, horrible stuff. Um, sorry. Uh, I'm not sure why I'm saying sorry. I didn't say anything. Uh, but, you know, horrible, horrible. Really, really feel for the children. I mean, they're quite young, so they might not know what's going on. By the look of the pictures, they might be older. I don't know. But I feel real bad for them. I mean, you lose your mum and then your dad did it. That's possibly the worst. You know? Your dad now? Like, it really is, isn't it? It really is. There's still ads on here. So, former Miss Switzerland finest was st allegedly strangled, dismembered, and then pureed by a blender, according to her autopsy, as her husband faces a murder trial. So, obviously, he's off the... You know, he's on trial. Has he done it? Has he not? I don't know. I'd like to see the defense. She tripped. She fell. And she landed in a blender. We do not know how, but that is what happened. Jury, please vote accordingly. We've all made accidents. Remember when Gordon Ramsay put his hand in a blender by accident? That was fake. That's what you think. The remains of catwalk coach Christina, 38 by the way, so young, were discovered in a home near Basel in Switzerland. Switzerland. Ah, yes, welcome to Switzerland. We are so happy here. Yes, we turn people into pure stop local swiss media fm1 today report that the country of the autopsy the body was dismembered in the laundry room with a jigsaw power tool all right one of them bad boys man so not only do you have you know hate this person enough to kill them like you can chop them up and throw them in a blender and i don't know did he try drinking it let's continue to read jigsaw oh fuck why do i keep itching jigsaw tool knife and a secateur don't worry, I know no one knows what a succoteur is. Sounds El Francais, if you ask me. Beep. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's for trimming your um, it's for, it's for trimming your bushes or your plants. You know, when it gets a bit high. I mean, what what's he cutting off with that? Maybe a couple fingers. I don't know. But anyway, delve deeper. Several body parts were then pureed with a hand blender and dissolved in a chemical. Good luck explaining that one, lawyer man. Basil reported that her husband Thomas claimed he had acted in self-defense after she attacked him with a knife and then dismembered her body in the laundry room in a state of panic. Wow, so he then played, No, she attacked me first. No, she attacked me first, please. No, I just, uh, you know, I was not thinking. I thought maybe she would prefer to be in Blender when we have her funeral. Yeah, she did not know. I don't know what accent this is. I just drink is like how they speak. So obviously he bullshitted. I mean, that's pretty clear. Um, I feel like if you, uh, you know, accidentally killed someone, someone you loved, you'd probably feel a bit guilty. Uh, just a suggestion. Again, this this whole premise just shows how humans are just dirtbags. I've seen a few people on the internet say, if this doesn't convince you men are the worst, I don't know what will. Sexism. But yeah, men are the worst. Um, 
certainly but there are plenty of women who are just as bad so let's you know let's be honest the problem isn't men the problem isn't women the problem is just human beings generally you know just human species x y x x y y i don't care what you are if you don't have any chromosomes which i know some of you don't humans are the problem here he had an appeal uh for release from custody denied by the fed court after reportedly confessing to killing oh she won 2000 winner of the northwest switzerland with whom he had two two kids i did mention he had kids fucking terrible uh the forensic report basically said she did die from strangulation thomas showed a lack of empathy cold bloodedness and then he tried to cover it up i mean it's horrible isn't it you know these poor kids these poor uh daughters they have are going to one day grow up knowing that their dad murdered their mother and tried you know putting them in the smoothie machine i mean there's just there's plenty of horrible ways to go i mean here she is you know very pretty um she, you know, won Miss Switzerland in the north or whatever, and then got to the final. So she's clearly, you know, a hot commodity. Apologies, that was a horrible way of phrasing it, but you know what I mean. And he obviously got jealous. Maybe she was seeing someone else. Maybe uh, she threatened getting rid of him because she had enough of his BS. And he thought, well, if I'm not having you, no motherfucker can. Sliced her into tiny little pieces, put her in a blender, and then, yeah, got caught, rightly so. I mean, me personally, what should happen? I think um, an eye for an eye, so um, w- which would mean death. I think it'd be more funny if we just cut off his legs. Is that a bit crazy behaviour? I don't know. You know what I mean? Just say, look, we'll let you live, but you're going around in a wheelchair for the uh, for the rest of the di- your time. he will be like, oh no, just kill me. Please. And you'd be like, no man. It's got to be done. Get doctor in here. <laughs> Using the same ridge, whatever, hacksaw ridge. <laughs> That's a film, isn't it? But yeah, very, very sad um, to hear. What do you guys think? Have you got any theories, any opinions down below? Poor her, poor family. I mean, this guy's a real dirtbag again. I know I said it before, but it just shows you cannot trust anyone. Be careful out there. Even the people you marry, you can't trust these days. But yeah, Miss Switzerland finalist was strangled to death, then dismembered and tried disposing of in a blender, which is just fascinating, isn't it? Um, But yeah, you've got to be a real sick individual to not only kill him, your wife, then slice them up, and try blend, get, you know, fucking horrid. I mean, I don't understand how people think they can get away with it, you know what I mean? Like, uh, modern criminology is just too good. You're getting caught, bro, getting caught. You get caught these days for saying something on Twitter the government doesn't agree with, so, you know, I think you're definitely going to get fucking arrested for killing and dismembering your your love. I mean, the mother of your kids as well. F- ugh nasty guys anyway very sad story but you know justice will be done he will be arrested i'm sure and you know hopefully they have the death penalty in switzerland yeah i don't know i don't care she she the life has been lost and the kids are the real uh, victims here as well you know what are they gonna do 